The day was flying to Sokoto, the uh, northwest of Nigeria. And this was uh, the capital of the northwest, and where uh, Nate Othman and Fudu came as a Muslim leader to fight shirk and beda, and to, uh, which was spreading at that time in this area. Uh, Inshallah, so I will arrive there today. And yesterday we have two days a workshop about resilience, about the agenda of uh, the agenda of uh, climate change and uh, affecting the population here in Nigeria. It was high level two days workshop which talks about resilience, about empowerment of young men and women, about empowerment of local community about building partnership, building coalition, building platforms, building stronger net, net, uh, communication network system, building all this to enable the people of Nigeria. So Nigeria is a rich country as we all know, but unfortunately the people are poor as we can understand. So these two days workshop will feed into our conference in Turkey on the 26th of October which talks about resilience as well by WAF, WAF conference in Shadow. Uh, what I'm saying here today, on yesterday and the previous day, we found that the level of discussion among the participants here were as good as you people in Europe and America, and higher than a lot of other American and European countries, as well as Middle Eastern countries who think that they have probably seen with the donors from America and Europe, and those people don't know the know-how of that. And I'm very excited for uh, having come to Nigeria to visit Nigeria for the first time. It's not going to be the last time. And uh, inshallah, we'll be able to come again and again and again and invite all of you to come and do investment in Nigeria, to come and do humanitarian work, social work, uh, development work, uh, raising awareness, advocacy, and other things. And in this area, in the northeast of Nigeria, there is a lot of displacement, more than one million people, by, by two factors. Factor number one is the lack of security because of the organization called Boko Haram. The second factor is the climate change, which was a part of our discussion yesterday and before yesterday. So, inshallah, we will talk with you from a different place in Nigeria, at least you go to tomorrow or tonight, and to see the wealth of the country and you need to be with the people of Nigeria here. See you inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.